Doppler 12 Futurecast. No denying that uh, winter is here now with the temperatures that we've been seeing today, teens and 20s this morning, and we're still trying to work our way out of the 20s in many areas. We've also had a few flurries and snow showers that have clipped the coastline. They're pulling away now, and the skies have been clearing pretty quickly behind that. As we look at the wider view, still just some flurries over uh, Nantucket this noontime, and that too will move away. Now, some of our computer models showing one more batch of perhaps some flurries that will come up and clip our area during the uh, first part of the night tonight, perhaps right around midnight, seeing some flakes flying. I'll show you that in the future cast, but out and about next few hours, weather is nice and quiet, but it is chilly. It's 28 in Pasco. The temperature is running cooler than average in Providence. You can see the blue skies here, very dry air overhead, west winds at nine miles an hour, and that humidity at 37%. Uh, New Bedford's running at about 29 right now, and the winds between 10 and 12 miles per hour there, giving us a wind chill still in the upper teens and the uh, humidity below 50%. So we're going to keep it uh, fairly quiet here for a threat tracker future cast starting off the new year tonight, tomorrow. Uh, no storms in the forecast, but we do have one for the weekend, one that potentially could give us a little burst of wintry weather at the start. Trough moved through here earlier uh, today. It's now sitting off to our south. That was that little batch of uh, flurries and snow showers. Now we just have some lake effect snow and actually some lake effect clouds that are stretching now down across central New England. And we'll get a little bit of that uh, fair weather cloud cover over at least interior parts of Rhode Island through the afternoon and perhaps early evening before they tend to just fade away. So here we go, two o'clock this afternoon, mainly sunny skies, and we'll keep that during the early evening hours. We're we'll out getting ready to hit a New Year's Eve celebration. Looking quiet for most areas. Notice this little flurry that it has clipping the coastline right around midnight tonight. Best chance of seeing a few flakes tonight would be on the islands, Block Island, Nantucket, Martha's Vineyard, before this pulls away. And then as we get into tomorrow morning, we're back to clear skies, another cold start. But the temperatures in the afternoon will be back into the low and mid 30s. There'll be a little bit more of a wind on Thursday, so that'll keep us very chilly feeling. 32 for this afternoon, mostly sunny with those west northwest winds at 5 to 15 miles per hour, down to about 18 by dawn tonight as we are cold and dry for most areas. These are some of the temperatures I'm forecasting for midnight tonight 22 Providence, 19 in Woonsocket at midnight, Warwick around 21, Newport at about 25, New Bedford and Fall River in the lower 20s. We're doing a polar plunge tomorrow. Well, as expected, it's going to be chilly. Water temperatures around 44. Air temperature will be in the middle 30s. And again, you're going to have that wind that'll be fairly busy through the day, gusting up to 20 and 25 miles per hour. Seven day future cast. We're quiet through Saturday daytime, but then Saturday night into Sunday, we're watching a storm. Right now, I'm thinking we could see several hours of perhaps a wintry mix of snow, sleet, or freezing rain before changing over to a heavy soaking rain. You can always get that updated future cast online.